Hey, welcome to the Couch GM. I hope you're able to tune in to the Mariners Angels game last night. It was the definition of chaos ball. Uh, but the Mariners pulled it off. They won the game six to two last night against the Angels, which moves them into first place in the wild card. So they're now a half game ahead of the Tampa Bay Rays, the Toronto Blue Jays, and then behind the the Blue Jays and Rays are now the Orioles, the Twins, and the White Sox. We'll get into the game from last night. Uh, Luis Castillo pitched a great game. He went six innings, giving up six hits, two runs, one walk with nine strikeouts. And he faced Shohei Otani last night. Otani went six innings, giving up seven hits, two earned runs, uh, one walk with eight strikeouts. And this game last night really had it all. It had a homer that wasn't a homer, but it was a homer, which I'll get into in just a moment. Uh, there was also a homer that was a homer, but it wasn't a homer. Uh, there was also a three ball walk to Carlos Santana late in the game. Uh, there was four consecutive misplays in the ninth um, on behalf of the Angels, which, I mean, cost them the game. There was also, to end the game, a foul ball. No, it hit him. No, he swung. No, he's in and he's injured. Final out of the game. So it was chaos last night, but let's get into it. So here, earlier in the game, um, one of the Angels players hit a ball to deep right center field, and we'll just play the play the footage. He's, calling, he's calling as a center fielder. That's his ball. Uh, it doesn't look like it went over the wall though. No. Although it was it was up there for a while. And here's a better angle. Maybe they kept it in play. It would have been a home run for sure. We have a crew chief challenge. Oh, oh it's, it's a, a home run. That's a home run. He's calling. He's for calling it. as a center so fielder. That's see, his ball. As you see, it looks like Julio was calling off Hanniger. Um, the ball went in and out of Julio's glove, bounced over the wall. So it wasn't a home run, but then it turned into a home run. So that's that was the how the game started. Um, a, an inning or two later, Julio Re Rodriguez hit, hit a ball that was ruled a fair ball initially by the umps. They all got together and overturned it to a fair uh, foul ball. And then Scott Service challenged the call of, of it being uh, foul. And it was upheld by New York, so it was technically a, fair, a foul ball. But if you look at the footage, I mean, it clearly shows the ball going behind the foul pole. So it being fair. So this one was a home run that technically wasn't a home run because it was upheld as a foul ball. Moving on into the late innings of the game. In the ninth inning... This is the definition of chaos ball right here. Julio Rodriguez up at the plate. We got guys on first and second with one out. And the count 2-0. Oh. Pitch to Julio. Line draw! Line drive was knocked down. Play at the plate. Now they got Haggerty hung up. Timo coming to third. Runner scores! Runner to third. Safe! Wow. How about that? Just poor, poor defense. Um, if you go back here. So they throw home. Haggerty's running back to third. The catcher throws it to, thir to the third baseman, and then he completely disregards Haggerty, who's running home scoring with just one out. I believe there wasn't anyone at the plate in order to, to catch the ball, but then they throw back to the third and not in time. The next at bat, Ty, the next at bat, Ty France. Ground ball. They're gonna come home. Instead of deciding to go for the, the double play to end the inning, Ty France can't really run very well, so it would have been pretty much a guaranteed double play. Uh, the shortstop decides to throw it home instead to try to get Dylan Moore. And he dropped the ball! Dylan Moore scores! Here comes Julio! Manny will hold him there, going to second. Wow. It's Ty so instead of getting out of the inning with a double play right there, the Angels instead throw it home, ball deflects, Dylan Moore scores. Guys on second and third now with just one out. France! What an inning. Go and there's, of course, the Angels fans' reactions, as you might imagine. Goodness! 0 oh, 1 to Jesse. It's that the Rojas. He stumbles. Another run scores. Wow! Heading the count. So that's the ninth inning, which uh, Mariners end up scoring four runs in the ninth to put them up 6 to 2, and the Angels wouldn't come back from that. Again, the reaction from the Angels fans. And then to end the game, this is uh, an interesting play here. So you can see that he goes around, 
but since the ball hit his hand and not the bat, um, it wasn't a foul ball. And since he did swing, it was technically strike three. So this was this is the final out of the game. And as as Joe Adele was getting attended to by the trainers, you could see the Mariners were doing their their dance to end the game, victory dance. And I saw Angels fans on Twitter getting upset about this because, as you can see, Joe Adele was getting treated to at the time. So we'll see if there's any, you know, uh, an opener to, at tonight's game for the Angels to see if they uh, decide to start another another brawl or something like that. But with the win over the Angels last night, the Mariners move into first place in the wild card for the first time this season. They're a half game ahead. They have two more games. Let's take a look at their schedule. Let's see here. The Mariners have two more games against the Angels uh, tonight and tomorrow, and then they go to, to uh, Oakland for three games and then back home against the Nationals for two. Tonight is going to be Robbie Ray versus Jose Suarez. So uh, tune in for the game tonight. We'll see if uh, the chaos continues. And uh, if you like this content, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, give it a share, and go Mariners, and we'll see you later. All right, guys, goodbye, Zondi. Don't forget it. Stop it.